Hello and welcome to another Slippy Limpets video. Uh, the car is fully loaded. I've got my kayak up on the roof there. Lockdown is still in process, so I can't go fishing in Scotland or anything, or Wales, so i um, having to stick with uh, kayak fishing at the moment, but um, really enjoyed the last trip, which was on uh, Wednesday, just a, uh, last week. Caught a few cards, some small ones, but hopefully um, today we might get something bigger, or I've brought a light rod with me so I can maybe uh, use some shore lures and hopefully maybe find a pollock or two. That's the plan, but uh, the tide is tiny, so it works really well for fishing with light gear, but the uh, wind is quite a bit stronger than um, than what was forecast. It's uh, absolutely glass in the morning and then in the evening, it's howling with wind. I actually went for uh, my usual bike ride this morning and I counted 13 kayaks out here, so uh, hopefully they've left with some fish. I'm just gonna get set up and uh, my mate Phil's gonna come down and meet us in about 10 minutes. <laughs> Got a bit of an addition to me drogue today, new part. Got a carabiner with a swivel on it. Fish on! Oh, that was too quick. Oh, my handle's come off me reel. Oh, you are joking. Oh, that's not much good, lads. Pollock! That was literally the first drop there, like. Nah, it's just a little in. Oh, Jesus, I'm 
way to retire myself at this rate. So uh, my handle's just snapped on my reel, if you can see that here. I'm trying to get it off, and our reel seat's come off, and now my reel is actually stuck on my rod. And I kind of get this off to put my other reel on. Oh, it's going to be one of those days. It was a bit of a false start on that drift. I figured out which way we're going and that's towards the shore. Um, I've broken my rod again, I've broken another reel. Gonna have a cigarette and calm down a little bit. Get some myself sorted out and then set up another drift. Make sure we get over some decent uh, ground. That's what we're looking for. Drop off of some structure. We'll try this drift without a, a drogue. Oh, I'm drifting really quickly. Quickly, actually, me lowers. I kind of keep me lower anywhere near vertical. I think what the key today, what the key is going to be, is to find the structure where the fish are, sit out the drogue, and then we're pretty much fishing on the same spot with static. Fish that area and then move on to the next. Don't think you can see that there, but I'll move that out of the way. See the drift line going that way. Apparently, I'm moving at zero kilometers an hour, but that's not right. Change up again. That's what I'm after. In a halfway house. Didn't even thread this through the eye. Going through a leg. Right, no else can go wrong now. Time for sandwich. Last week I had me mackerel. This week I've got brisket, spinach, horseradish, and uh, mayonnaise. Mm. Oh, Mexican. Secret ingredient, a Mexican chili cheese. Oh, that is delicious. Okay, I'm gonna have a piss now. I don't know what you're following me for. Uh, it's unlikely to be any fish here at the moment, the way things are going tonight. Right. Right, I'm going to paddle a bit further out and get this edge. <coughs> There's a drop off and then the shoulder. <coughs> Then I'm going to stick my drogue out. We only need to go about 50 metres or so. Get a little lure back out. Seems to have been doing the damage. Oh yeah, now that's better. Mark it for fish. A little lure, not drifting very quickly. Had a hit. Needless lure. The 
if I zoom in there, you can see my lure bumps in there, just around the top of the kelp line here. That's to try and entice a fish out. That might be lurking around in there and hopefully not get snagged at the same time. Oof, something just came out and had a hit there because it was standing still. Oh, it's trying again. Just sitting there. It wants it. As long as I can get it agitated enough, it might take it. Fuck off! You've got a death wish, bird. Ah, oh, my water bottle had super glue around the top. What? Super glue around the edge. I'm surprised they didn't fucking super glue me face to it. If I start sniffing the glue, I might have better luck. Finally a fish on the sawn off. <laughs> Hi. Woo! Feels like a pollock. There's quite a few down there now, mate. Yeah, it's... Let's go like a clappers for a pollock. Yeah, it's a good one. <laughs> Woo! Jesus. Oh, get in the net. Oh! <laughs> All the calamity. Oh, right at, right on the lip. Oh. Woo! <sighs> Makes up for all the fing around today, like all the farting about. I put up a canny scrap on the sawn off. Twenty gram crazy eel. Sorry, I haven't got anything on big lure so far. Oh, oh 
my ass. <laughs> Not quite as good this one. Whoa. Is it the same fish? <laughs> what? <It's this> <laughs> oh ho ho, yes. This twin brother. <laughs> Woo there, woo! Whoa! Whoa, that's bigger that one! Nice! Woo! I've got me scales actually! So, don't normally do this, but I'm going to give it away. Seven, eight with the scale, with the uh, lures. Go on, away you go. So it was seven, eight, and these were twelve ounces. So a six, eight, well, six, ten, even. Get in. <laughs> Surely I can't get one on the third cast. Fish on! <laughs> no way! <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> oh, might even be bigger this one! Come on! Whoa. Still going? This can't be a fish. Surely it's a seal. I can't stop it. The seal's got me fucking fish! Oh! Get off it! Oh, it was a good fish as well, that! Look at it! It's wrestling with me fucking... I just want me lure back, you can keep the fish! Oh! <laughs> no, nice, it's got the fish by the tail! Oh. <laughs> oh. oh, 
tug at it. Woo! <laughs> Craziness! Whoa! What a get! Oh, I can't believe that was my last one! Oh, that was mental. Eight o'clock on a Thursday, gotta show your appreciation. Although this is the last day for it. It's time for the government to do something to help these people out now. My little sister's an ICU nurse. So this is for you, Mary, and everyone else who's an NHS worker. Dave, I think you know who you are as well. It's just gone down from eight to 11, 12. Straight away, the big edge here, like. Get the drogue out. Sean. First fish on big lures. No way. Oh. <laughs> little foul coddling. It's a bit of a difference from the last fish. <laughs> Well, I think that's about it. It's been a bit of a crazy night, really. Broken my rod again <laughs> for the second week running. It's a good job I got a replacement due tomorrow. Um, I've broken my reel. Um, I'm gonna have to try and find a new handle from somewhere for that. Loads of other stuff went wrong, but uh, catching those two big Pollock has really made up for it. Uh, not the most productive nights, but. 14 pounds of pollock and two fish is uh, roughly is, is a canny night in my books. Thanks for watching, really appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a, a thumbs up. And uh, if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button, do that for me, that would be great. And don't forget to hit the bell so you get to see when the next video comes out. I'm gonna be trying to post weekly if I can. Um, but just depends on the weather and the fishing I guess but uh, anyway until the next one tight lines and uh, take care